Hi, welcome to It's Time to Review Something. Hi, welcome back to another review. Time for a review here. Well, like most of us, shaving the head, the face is uh, it's kind of an issue sometimes. It's very sensitive. Uh, depending on your face, your structure, and throughout the years, 22 years now, shaving my head has been a pain in the keister because either you ha I have no hair right here and I'll grow it on the sides and if you wear a hat you look like Krusky the Clown, take it off, you got a big bald spot for a landing strip. For years I've tried the Quick Bic shavers, I've tried the, the dollar, what's that, men's dollar shaver you see on TV. Don't waste your money on them guys, really. They are I didn't like them. They left more cuts and nicks on my head than you could have shook a stick at, right? They don't shave as well. So I tried to go to two different Philips electric razors. Uh, they just don't get as close. So they gave, come up with this little hand razor. I don't know who makes it. Uh, I don't know. Anyway, you're supposed to be able to follow your head and it shaves real good. You can do it in the water. Ladies and gentlemen, it sucked too. I don't get that close. I still have the nubs and it feels rough. I like the smooth. Okay, that's it. I like to smooth. So throughout the years, I've been on and off, on and off. So I actually buy the Gillette Fusions. There it is right there. And uh, this one here actually vibrates. You see the little light. And uh, I've never had a problem with these. I'm hoping the Bic one day, uh, Gillette comes out one day and comes up with a razor designed strictly for the heads. You know what I mean? And I use it on my face to trim up, and I have no problems with it. They are pricey for the uh, four pack. I think it's about eleven dollars uh, for five razor blades in here. And of course, if you buy the one with the, the electric guns, I've had this one now for about two years. I got two of them. I got one in my travel kit, and I got one right here that I keep in my bathroom at all times. Why? She got coupons for these, so now I got about twenty of these things. They're pretty good. But throughout the years, Gillette has been very good. As far as me shaving my face, it's close, my chin, right? I don't have no irritations, and mainly my head. Uh, it, it, some, this might only apply to us guys that have bald heads and keep them bald. But shaving your head with Gillette is a lot better than some of the stuff that I've seen out there from other companies. And like I said, the Dollar Shave Club for men, uh, I tried them. And I tried another one that you actually put the razor blade in and close, once again, I cut myself behind my ear, somewhere back here on the back of my head. I always cut myself. And uh, they really weren't worth it uh, in the long run. So in the long run, I will stick with Gillette brand until maybe something better comes along. I'm hoping Gillette, uh, one day I'm going to actually email them and maybe send them a copy of this video saying, Hey guys, Gillette, come out with the one that is designed to shave the head. You know what I mean? Give a little, give a little longer one of these blades and maybe flexes a little bit so you can shave evenly around your head. I think it's important. And uh, like I said, these are just small reviews today. Uh, big ones coming later on today or tomorrow. Uh, well, I'm actually gonna do the review, but it's gonna actually be under my hunting channel for our new crossbows coming in. But I just wanted to touch bases on a couple little things around that I find useful. And I felt that they deserve a review. Earlier I talked about the uh, Rory mouse traps. And now I'm talking about Gillette Fusion. Uh, it's a good razor. It's worth this money. And if you shave like I do every other day, you know, you shave your face. I'm retired. I don't really have to shave as you can tell by the, the mustache and the goatee or the thing, right? Uh, I could probably let my hair grow long. It looks silly, but like I said, right here in the middle, I have a receding hairline at the age of 24, and it just receded to the back of my head. That's all I can say. It's just one of those things. You know, they always say God made a few perfect heads, the rest they put hair on, right? <laughs> At least that's what this gorgeous cashier told me one time, but it doesn't matter. If you shave your face, your head, or even your back or your chest. Now, the back one, I actually have the one from Amazon with the razors in the back, and I can do it myself. Because I don't like a hairy back, and there's nothing I can do about that one. I've got tattoos back there I like to show and keep up once I get a little skinnier, maybe. So anyway, if you like it, uh, give me a thumbs up on my reviews, uh, thumbs down, comments, it don't matter. I'm picking up new subscribers. I like that. Uh, sometimes I get comments and people say, hey, this works for me, or hey, thank you, or they ask for more information. You can do that. I'm happy. Either way, so I thank you for watching my channel. I do appreciate it. And like I said, these are shorter, and I hope the review helps you understand uh, 
how important a good razor is to shaving. Okay? Thank you and have a good day. Thank you.